Happy birthday, dear Gearbiz and DJ Soulforce. Happy birthday to you. Pow! <laughs> no, it, it's not my birthday, guys. Gearbiz is celebrating their third anniversary. That was a surprise to me because uh, I thought Gearbiz was a little older than that. I thought Gearbiz had been around for a while. I owe a lot of uh, my channel's success to the quadcopters that I've reviewed. I guess about two years ago, I, I was a customer of Gearbest way before I started reviewing quadcopters for them. The OG original member, the uh, Nihui U807, uh, that was uh, way before I started doing reviews for Gearbest. <laughs> That takes me back right there, guys. Today I'm gonna uh, show some of the quads that I bought from Gearbest or I got from Gearbest for review and a couple of quads that uh, I have coming up for reviews. This uh, girl here I just reviewed uh, a couple of days ago. I posted that video and this is the uh, XK X300 sweet quad and Guys, so many of these other quads that I review for Gearbest, but also became keepers in my collection. I, this may sound like a, gear, a Gearbest commercial, but those guys have uh, helped me to present quadcopters to you guys uh, to, to show them and demonstrate them before you think about buying them. I uh, remember this girl here, I reviewed uh, Pocket Rocket with brushless motors, the X251. Gearbest asked me to show uh, five of my favorite quadcopters that I got from Gearbest. Now, they didn't specify <laughs> whether uh, the, these are quads that I bought from Gearbest or uh, I got for a review because, like I said, I was a Gearbest customer way before I started doing reviews for them. Coming up soon, I'm going to review the new JXD. 515 the 515 it's a Wi-Fi first-person view indoor or outdoor flyer uh, it's a micro size quad so I don't have a lot of micros in my collection but this will make a triplet for me with the black and green JXD scheme not too long ago on my channel and this is one of my favorites I got from Gearbest uh, the JXD 506 and remember this one came with a, uh, a 5.8 gigahertz first person view camera with the adjustable gimbal that gimbal also had dampening balls on it the stock camera can easily slide off and it leaves a uh, mount there that you can put uh, like the SEMA XAC camera holder in there uh, so I'm going to be flying that one real soon with the scam cam on it. This was the late uh, little sister, the JXD 510. And I took the stock camera off of that one. I've been flying this one around inside the house with uh, with an 808 keychain camera on there. Remember this? This is the uh, X8HG with altitude hold. And this one came with the, uh, a high def camera on the uh, amount that uh, didn't give any jello. Oh, by the way, right below that, uh, this review is coming up soon. This is the newest generation SEMA X8, the SW. SEMA has gone to marketing their drones to, I call them the uh, X generation kids who like to fly with their mobile devices. And this one, I have an open jet, but we'll take a quick look at it. This is a micro size, the 515, and it came in the same black and green color scheme. That's a tiny whoop. <laughs> so far, it's going to be tiny whooping it. This is for the, uh, the bad weather days, guys. I'm going to be doing some tests and uh, some reviews and having some fun in the house as well. Speaking of tiny whoops, <laughs> look for the review to come up here soon. This is the Warlock 80, and uh, it's a micro racer with a 5.8 gigahertz first person view camera built in. It's a brush motor, 
indoor racer but you can see the uh, the props are attached straight to the motors there's no gears uh, so even for brush motors she's got some some whoop to it we're gonna review that one soon uh, this one should buy buying with uh, any of my XK uh, transmitters that have the Futaba protocol because I ordered this one from Gearbest with the Futaba protocol speaking of uh, keepers from previous reviews this is the uh, uninspired you guys remember <laughs> remember the uninspired this is one of my favorites though that uh, I got from Gearbest to review and this is the WL Toys, uh, what was this, the Q333, yeah, this is the Q333A with the 5.8 gigahertz first person view, the uh, DJI Inspire clone, we call it the Uninspired, uh, that's, that one was definitely a keeper. Gearbest asked me to pick five of my favorites, that was just a uh, suggestion to help them out with the promo video. Uh, I think I picked at least <laughs> nine right here. Guys, everything that I kept in the uh, hangar are my favorites. Uh, who haven't I covered yet? Uh, the FreeX MCF X01. Uh, remember when I first reviewed this quadcopter, I got just the standard version. It was the quad and uh, the transmitter. I don't have it in the picture right now. And then later, uh, Gearbest was kind enough to send me the, the free x3 axis gimbal and that really transformed uh no matter how rugged it flew this is a three axis gimbal and uh that gimbal provide some really really nice video i did a review on that one as well so guys i'm not going to take a long time doing this uh this was my way of uh helping the guys at gearbest who have helped us on this channel uh have access to these quads so i can review them and uh, for those of you guys who follow me and uh, subscribe to my channel, thanks for believing in what I believe in. Right now, my, my hat is off to Gearbest. Uh, just finding out that uh, they're only three years old. This has been a booming industry. It's been hard to keep up with supply and demand. And remember, these guys are servicing the whole planet. <laughs> Everybody's flying drones now, guys. <laughs> this your boy DJ Soul Force. I'm out of here. Shit, don't forget about my book bag, baby. My book bag, baby. My book bag, baby. <laughs> <laughs>